guys, what's up? It's Natalie. Welcome to or welcome back to my YouTube channel. So today I am going to be showing you guys my light natural makeup routine. I do this makeup every single day. It's very light, very natural, but still... It still looks like you gave effort, basically. Yeah, I think it's super easy, too. So let's just get on with the video. So the first thing I'm using is this Age Shield Face um, Oil-Free Lotion by Neutrogena. And it has SPF in it, SPF 110, which I did not know they made it like that high. And a goal of mine this summer was to wear... SPF because I never do and that's really bad um so I'm gonna put this on I've been trying to put SPF on every single day I already did my face literally I did my face also if you hear my here's like heavy breathing it's my dog he wants to be in the video really badly yeah I already put it on my face before the video and I'm just kind of putting it on my neck next thing I want to put on is this Poreless Face Primer. I love this stuff. I got it at Ulta. It's so cheap too, which we love a cheap product, but it works good. Um, but I just put that kind of all over my face. Um, for the days I do wear foundation, which isn't very often, um, but the days that I do, I put that on because I like the way my foundation holds when I use that product. Ooh, so nice so smooth okay next for foundation i'm going in with this infallible pro matte l'oreal 24 hour foundation i like my foundation really matte i don't like the glowy look on me i just feel like i just look greasy and i don't know if that's just a oopsies that's just a me thing probably is but yeah i like the look of matte on my face especially during the day i just put like very little on um i kind of just like not scratch but like slide it onto my face like i don't put like a, a big drop and then mix it in i feel like this is what i always do like this is my go-to especially during the summer it's just natural and light which i love i'm very into like the natural look on myself just because i feel crazy when i like wear certain colors on my face especially with like eyeshadow well, i guess i only wear colored eyeshadow where else would i add color on myself it was really stupid of me to say but yeah i just kind of put this all over my face like one would do since it's summer it is hot out so I don't like to wear anything very full coverage. I'm not really doing much. I'm just like running errands. I do use the infallible L'Oreal one, but when I'm going out like at night, I, I use my Too Faced Born This Way one. This one's very, very high coverage. But if I'm just running errands, I don't need like a full cakey face. So I just use this one. Then I just go in with my Maybelline Fit Me. I use... I mean, if you've ever watched any of my makeup videos, you've seen this. I swear by this. I don't use concealer. However, I do have bags underneath my eyes. I don't like the look of concealer on myself because I feel like it creases a lot, like where my eye is. So I just use this stuff. I use the same brush I use my foundation on, like, and I just put that underneath. I kind of just, like, rub it in, kind of like a loose powder. Um, and I don't know if you guys can see, but this eye looks like I got so much sleep. And this eye just looks like I didn't get enough sleep. Oh, I love this product. And it's so cheap, too. Boom, boom. Maybe my eyes are just different. They're not twins. They're, like, cousins. I don't know. And then whatever's, like, left on the brush, I just kind of, like, tease spot where I get oily, my chin, and kind of, like, my laugh. And lines, circles. I don't know what they're called. <laughs> Next thing I do is contour a bit. This is Toasty um, by Kylie. I do love Kylie's stuff. However, I think I did get the wrong color because I think it's like a little bit too light. And I just put this on my forehead to look a lot tanner. Um, this is a lot lighter than what I normally get. I used to use the Too Faced. Oh, the Too Faced. Um, what is this chocolate soleil bronzer i used to use this like a lot yeah this one's a lot darker than the kylie one but i like how kylie's is like so 
light on my face i don't even feel it and since it's summer and i like to be a little girly um i use blush this is the kylie pink dreams it looks a lot darker on camera it's not that dark kind of like when i smile i put it on my nose too i don't know if that's like normal or people even do that but i I like the look of my nose looking burnt a little bit. Okay, up next is my eyebrows. I use the Done in One Brow Pro Made. Um, this is by Salon Perfect. It just like comes in this like little, I broke it, I dropped it. <laughs> but this is what I use. A lot of people like the sticks. I just think this works the best for me. And I use like this little spoolie and this kind of, I don't know how to be a beauty guru, but like I use, that kind of brush um it's just something i've always done i used to when i was little i used to wear um think you're breathing so heavy um when i was little i used to just take eyeshadow and fill them in that way because my eyebrows were so bushy but i still wanted to be a part of the trend do you know what i mean um so that's what i used to use and i used to use one just like this too like that kind of brush i think that's why i really like this kind of brush i just feel like it gets everything the way i like it you know what i mean like nothing too crazy because my brows are very dark as it is um i don't really like overline them or make them thicker or anything I just kind of follow the naturalness of them. <laughs> so yeah, little bit to my tea. Cheerios. Been drinking hot tea like every single morning. It just really gets me going. So on days that I'm doing like my natural, I'll either wear no eyeshadow or I'll use my Urban Decay primer stuff that I always use. Just dot it, dot it. That looked a little too scary. I rub that in a little bit, and I've been loving. I've had this palette for so long, just like never really used it. It's the Too Faced Natural Lust palette, and the colors in this, hello, all in one. You know what I mean? Um, I really like um the pinks and the whites in this and like the creams so i'm going in with love language it's like this like i don't even know kind of like off maroon color and not just all over i like when everything is matte like when i go out out at night i like to be shimmery but every day i just really like to be matte okay now i'm going in with take the cake and i'm literally putting it right on top it's just like this light pink color i'm focusing it more on like the i don't even know what this is whatever this is i don't really think it does much but in my eyes i like to think it does um now i'm probably gonna go in with after Del afternoon delight same brush i really don't care that i mix my colors at all I feel like it kind of adds like a little spice to the look. Does she know how to apply makeup? Debatable. I used to have eyelash extensions. Um, however, this pandemic came and everything shut down and now I'm too lazy to even go back. Which is very bad because I really used to like them a lot. I'm trying to get like my eyelashes right. Um, I loved how they looked on me. However, and my makeup routine was so different. I literally just got up, did my eyebrows, put a little um, contour on, and left. Because I can't bring myself to buy a whole set of eyelash extensions. Um, but the worst part about fake eyelashes like these you have to wait i am the most impatient person you will ever meet in your life i can't i hate waiting it's something i definitely need to work on i know and i'm very embarrassed to say how impatient i am but i'm so impatient i got these off of shein i usually not to go this crazy full but these are like the only ones i could find that's on my counter at the moment so we're just gonna make them work <laughs> but i got them off of shein i literally got i think 20 
like two sets of 10. Maybe it was two sets of 15. I don't remember, but I know it was something like that. And they were like $4. How can you beat that? My natural eyelashes are very thin and um, short. And I don't know if it's because of the eyelash extensions or what. Also, my eyes are just very sensitive in general. When I used to do dance when I was little, I used to have to wear fake eyelashes for competitions and stuff. And my eyes would literally tear up. And I don't know if I have like a condition or something that like makes my tank. I don't know if I have like a condition that makes my eyelids like that or eyeballs like that that irritates them but it always happens to me and it happened when I was little and I don't know why. Okay, now that that is done, I'm going to take my voluminous L'Oreal uh, waterproof. <gasps> this is what, oh, okay. So I've never like read this. I just knew it was like voluminous. Um. And I could not figure out why this was so hard to take off because I usually use these two together. This is the Tarte something. I think it's like lights, camera, action one. And I got this in like a little travel kit. Um, and I love this one so much because it's so easy to take off. And this one is so hard. And I'm like, why, is, why, why now? I guess they have two of these. One's waterproof, one's not. But oh my god, it is so hard to take off. I'm just gonna use this one today. But I'm just gonna go on the top, just so they kind of like stick together. I don't really do the bottom ones, like my bottom eyelashes, because it makes my eyes look very dark and I don't want that. We're trying to be light. Also, if you have problems with um, oily skin, like oily, like your face is very oily, you don't know what to do because your face is oily um i recommend getting this neutrogena um shine control powder i found this off of tiktok i think i'm pretty sure but i used to use this a lot when, when i like didn't really know how to do makeup um and i'd keep this everywhere i go and my face was just always matte i love um so yeah it looks like this and it's like translucent powder basically and you don't get flashback either so yeah the more you know thank you guys so much for watching don't forget to like comment and subscribe and tell me if you guys like my natural makeup or do you guys like when i do like all out and crazy anyways guys thank you so much for watching and i'll see you guys in my next video bye guys